If you clicked on this video, that only means one thing. The Roblox games that you're playing right now have gotten boring and are not fun to play anymore. And you clicked on this video to find some addicting Roblox games that you can play that will not only cure your boredom, but will have you playing for hours. And you can play these games by yourself or with your friends, and you'll have so much fun. But wait a minute, before I show you those games, make sure to watch the entire video because I'm going to be hiding one of these Robux codes somewhere random in the video. So make sure to watch the entire video because if you find this code, you can redeem it and get some free Robux. Alright, I'm not going to waste any more of your time, let's get straight into the games. Number 15, Burger Game. Hmm. Hmm, I wonder what this game's about. It definitely doesn't explain any of it in the title. Well, if it's not obvious already, this game is about cooking burgers. But it's not just about cooking burgers. You have to run a whole burger joint at the same time. And you have to work with other players to do that. And if a lot of random players or some of your friends are in the game, it can get chaotic real fast. Because once the orders come in, you have to put the burgers together. You have to cook the patties. So you get all that meat in the burger. You have to put it all on the platter make sure the order is right, cook up some fries and serve up a drink, and then take it out to the customer, collect the money, and then take the tray back to the dishwasher, and then repeat that all over again. You also really have to make sure you don't run out of ingredients, and you also have to have people managing the drive through and your whole team needs to be working the best they can, because if you guys go bankrupt, it's all over. I know this game kind of sounds complicated, but it's so fun, the game looks great, and it's very addicting. I would definitely check out this Roblox game, and don't don't forget all the links to these games will be in the description down below. Number 14, Doodle Pets. Even though this is a pet game on Roblox, I think it has a super unique twist and the art style is just awesome. In Doodle Pets, you start off with a super low level pet that looks like it was drawn by a first grader. And then with your pet, as you go around the map, you get the opportunity to catch other players or other NPCs pets so you can add them to your collection. And as you battle and collect more and more pets, you're able to form super OP pairs of pets because different pets have their own special set of skills, which if you play your cards right, helps you to get a strategic advantage. For example, one pet can have a lot of defense, so it can last a long time without being taken down, but have absolutely garbage attack, and some could be pretty balanced, or some could have special abilities that allow the pet to sacrifice itself to give all its health to another pet, so it can win the battle. And what I really enjoy about this game is the amount of different worlds that you can explore, and also like I said at the beginning, the unique art style that this game offers makes this game 100% worth checking out. Number 13, Sushi Merge. Guys, I think this might be one of the cutest Roblox games on this list, like, ever, like, literally. Like, look at all the cute sushis. Sorry for the jokes, but this game is not only just cute, but it's actually pretty fun to play as well. This game is pretty self-explanatory, where basically sushi gets dropped down, and you have to merge the sushi so that you can get higher levels of sushi, and the higher level sushi you get and the longer you last for without the sushi all piling to the top the higher you get on the leaderboard and the closer you get to being number one who is the sushi king and like i said i personally think this game is super adorable and not only that but it's very addicting as well which is what we're looking for in this video definitely check out sushi merge number 12 card battles card battles is actually a pretty unique game where you have to collect a bunch of different cards and all the cards can have one of three different powers and there's fire, water, and ice. And when you battle another person with your deck of cards, the game plays out like rock, paper, scissors. So for example, water beats fire, fire beats ice, and ice beats water. So on every turn, each player plays a card and they have to try to predict what the other person is going to pick so that their element can beat their element. And for every element that you win with, it gets added up to your score, and the first person to collect three of one element, or one of all three different elements, wins that game. This game is actually pretty fun, and I find it enjoyable. If you're just looking for something simple, but competitive at the same time, with some strategy involved, this game is definitely for you. Number 11, Skyvin. This is probably a game that you've never seen on Roblox before, and that you might think is dumb at first, but you realize how well this game is built, and you'll fall in love with it. In Skyven, you get spawned in as a bird, and for brand new players, it's a sparrow, but you can unlock a bunch of different birds like parrots and bald eagles and much more. And when you play as a bird, you can play in two different modes. One being free roam, which you can explore the huge map and just fly around without worrying about anything, or you can play in survival 
which is like Minecraft, but if you were a bird. You have to fly around and make sure you don't take fall damage or you get too tired. You have to build your own nest. You have to make sure you're fed and also rested. And you have to find your own food. And you can lay your own eggs and have your own birds and so much more. I'm surprised that this Roblox game isn't more popular because I think it deserves to have thousands of players. I would definitely check it out for yourself to see if what I'm saying is true. Number 10, Obby, but you're a spider. If you have arachnophobia, do not play this game. In this Roblox game, your character is morphed into a spider, and your mission is to make it out of the obby by shooting webs and sticking to them on walls and swinging like a spider without falling so you can make it to the other side. This obby is actually pretty challenging, but my favorite part about this game is like how I said before that your character is morphed into a spider, which even though it's creepy, it's actually kind of funny. It just looks so goofy, but oddly satisfying at the same time. This game is definitely worth checking out. Number 9, Average Plate Game. This game is exactly what the title says, it's your average plate game, but in my opinion, it's honestly way above average. Pause. In this survival game, you have to survive on different plates that have a bunch of natural disasters occurring on them, like alien invasions, sandstorms, fires, and so much more. But you also have power-ups as well that can help you take out other players so that you're the last one standing, or help revive you, or give you some type of boost. It honestly takes a lot of skill to survive these rounds. As you can see, I died so many times but this is a super fun game and i absolutely love the map design number eight super scuffle i'm genuinely serious if you do not play this roblox game you are stupid this is one of the most underrated roblox games of all time Super Scuffle is like Mario 64, mixed with a free roam fighting game with an insanely cool art style. Like look how cool this Roblox game is. I literally just play this Roblox game just to run around and have fun. But it has this awesome element of being able to fight other people and collect weapons all around the map. And fighting other players in this game is actually pretty fun, but just getting back to how cool the map is, almost everything is interactive. Like you can talk to characters that are around the map, there's things that will teleport you, shoot you off the map, and there's so many different worlds in one map, each with its own cool, unique characteristics. Like for example, the cactuses in the western part of the map will damage you if you touch them. Like the developers didn't need to add all these cool things, but they did. And you won't believe it when I say it, but this Roblox game literally only averages 50 players. This is definitely one of the most underrated Roblox games ever, and you're crazy if you don't check it out. Number 7, Star Tactics. I bet you've never seen a game like this on Roblox before. And be warned, this game requires a lot of strategy. So if you have a big brain, you're gonna wanna play this Roblox game. But if you have a little itty bitty brain, then this isn't for you. In Star Tactics, your goal is to conquer the entire galaxy by capturing as many bases as possible, but there's a problem. There's an opponent that's trying to do the same thing. And while your goal is to conquer the entire galaxy, you have to eliminate the opponent. And how the bases work is once you capture one that can fly to other bases or fortify your own base, which you can upgrade to add more defense or to produce more ships. And the strategy comes in where you send ships out to either capture unclaimed bases or take over one of your opponents. This game is super fun. I would 100% check it out. Number six, Rail Frenzy. This is a super unique Roblox game and I haven't seen anything like it before. In Rail Rail Frenzy, your goal is to get the train all the way to the station. And you do that by cutting down trees, mining boulders, and crafting train tracks to get the train to its destination. But you gotta be careful because this train is always slowly moving and you need enough time to create tracks so that the train doesn't fall off. Also, you have to beware of the train overheating and you have to get a bucket of water to cool the train cart down. This is definitely one of the most unique games I've seen on Roblox in a while. So go check out Rail Frenzy. Number five, my bike life. This game is made by a fellow YouTuber named Robuilder, and it's in its alpha testing stages, but nonetheless, I think it's still really fun, and I thought I should add it to this list. In my bike life, you spawn in, and you start with a little moped, but as you ride around the open world and do a bunch of cool tricks on all the cool ramps and obstacles, you start to earn up cash, which you're able to use to afford cooler bikes. I think you should definitely keep your eye on this game, especially if you love motorbikes, because it's only in its alpha stage, and I feel like there's so much more to come from 
from this game. Number 4, Super Block 64. Have you ever played Super Mario 64? Well imagine that, but on Roblox. In this storyline, you're in debt to somebody, and the cops are forcing you to go out and collect these player points, and once you collect 50 of them, then you're home free. But you have to learn various moves, and travel through different levels to collect these player points, and you have to collect gems at the same time to move on to the next levels. I really love the aesthetic of this game just because it's super simple, and the controls are very unique, and it does require some skill to get past some of these levels. You really have to maneuver your way through different obstacles, climb on different walls, jump huge gaps, and much more. Trust me, this game is so fun and it's worth playing, so definitely check it out. And remember, all the links to these games will be in the description down below, so if you want to play them after this video, you can go ahead and do that. Number 3, Become Forklift Certified. Have you ever wanted to become Forklift Certified? Well, now you can in this fun, exciting Roblox game. You might think it's boring riding around in a forklift in a stupid Roblox obby, but trust me, it's actually super fun. I found so much enjoyment out of this game, and your goal is to navigate through different courses by making really tight turns and lifting your fork up and down to get through all the different obstacles so that you can finally become forklift certified and achieve all your dreams. The like to dislike ratio on this game is insane. It has so many dislikes, but the only reason that is is because people suck at the game. So I challenge you to play this Roblox game and see if you can do better. Number two, Spin Down. Spin Down is an absolutely crazy game and requires some strategy if you want to make it through alive. In Spin Down, there's a bunch of different games where you have to put your life on the line in order to come out on top and win. The concept of this game is pretty similar to Breaking Point, but taken to a whole new level. There's a class game, there's a game with a huge spinner, but my favorite is the pinball style game, where there's three rounds, and the loser of each round gets some health taken from them. And at the end of it all, we see who the actual winner is. And the more you win, the more chips you get, which you're able to use to unlock special skins, and much more. So if you like Roblox games like Breaking Point, this game is definitely worth checking out. Number 1, Roses. Roses is a psychological thriller puzzle game, which I'm very surprised isn't more popular. This game is set in a psych ward that's been abandoned and your mission is to figure out what happened here, but you're gonna run into a lot of problems. I'm not gonna spoil this game for you, but you have to check it out, especially if you love Roblox horror games. Speaking of Roblox horror games, if you love playing them, click on this video right here, where I share with you, in my opinion, some of the best Roblox horror games that you can play. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I hope you found some awesome Roblox games to play. Make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on any more of these lists, and I'll catch you in the next video.